knocked to the, uh, the front of the pack by Mark. Cable has it for Perth. Kicks back towards full forward. Shearer sizes up his options. Goes straight in the direction of centre half forward. And that's a good mark. Strong mark taken by Jackson. Venables as opposed to him at the moment. This is Cable. Soft surface. Knew he had someone outside, but Perth are under pressure here. Comes back to Cable. The ball is inside 50 metres now. Shearer. Here's Ma. Very mobile. Kicks to centre half forward and Jackson. Venables was got, got there to give the contest. Cable. High to half forward. Bertram oh. underneath it. Appeared to be pushed in the back. No risk. Play allowed to go on. Here's Cable again. Usually a good kick with the ball. Beautiful. Spinks on the end of it. Spinks has the mark. 45 metres. Corey Robinson wants to pick up Matt Gorsey, but Glenn Davies has gone to Robertson. So Gorsey's running around by himself a little bit, and uh, Perth will just need to be aware of that. Cable's had quite a few possessions in this first term. Kicks to half forward. Beautifully weighted. Thompson's taken the mark out there. And still 70 metres from goal, though. Just a slight nudge, not enough in it. Becoming the forgotten lure of football. Spinks slaps it to the side of the pack. Chance here for Cable. Can he pick it up in pursuit? Is McDonald? Was he held? Well, he was boxing for it. How did he get rid of that? Well, that's the point. I think you need to ask. I mean, I think that decision was probably pay on. Just the extra little bit of retardation from McDonald then caused uh, the free kick and umpire Peter Rapper indicating the mark, the direction certainly a grey area isn't it well his father would have bounced it wouldn't he in his era Shane Cable from 35 metres directly in front drops it onto the boot and makes no mistake there Perth have got five now they're 5-5, five, five, 35, Subiaco at 2-2, two, two, 14. And uh, Subiaco maybe need the next goal in this game. Free kicks in the game so far. Perth have got nine, Subiaco two only. Yes, interesting situation. This is Shane Cable. He really made hard work of this when he perhaps should have picked the ball up in the first instance. Holding the ball for mine. Well, uh, yes, he tapped it away to his own advantage. Was able to finish off all right. And, uh, you know, a bit of a danger sign here for Subiaco. They just need to consolidate for the next three or four minutes just towards the end. Chance for Perth again through Cable. Cable back towards the half forward line and Thompson with him McKenzie. And McKenzie has given away. So there'll be another bounce just inside Subiaco's 50 metre line. Nearly two minutes played in the second quarter as Morish knocks it down. Cable to Bertram. Bertram out towards the outer half. Full forward, Shearer over the top. Couldn't hold on that time. And the crumbs to Attard and away go the Lions. Adard kicks long towards the outer wing. McKenzie was out there, but Cable was too tall. Good mark to Shane Cable. He's just ahead of the centre line as Perth go back towards 50 metres. Target is Jackson. Thanks, Rod. He's kicked up towards half forward. Catch over was there, shoveled out by Hardingham, but it was chopped off by Morrish. He gives it away to Cable. He's been a bit quieter in this quarter. From left half forward, he drills it long. Chance at the back for Shearer. Oh, he's into the back of the Super come back quickly. Bertram squares it up. Allard takes the mark. No, plays on quickly. Gets it across to Cable. Cable, Thompson, or Quick. Quick's got it. He hooks it across his body. Hooks it too. Good old-fashioned footy. So the ball is back in Subi's court now as the bounce that time favours Jackson and then Perth as it's socket forward by McMurray. was taken by Burgess. Cable could just about kick that. He gets underneath it a little. High towards feeling a little the worse for wear as Simpson comes off the ground. It's bad luck for him. He was playing OK, but he ran into an accidental knee as Cable drives the Demons forward. They're applying plenty of pressure here at the moment and Shearer takes a very good mark. Great mark down and low. now he can kick to Thompson. Guards there for Perth. He's working in a very confined space. Hooks it across his body and running onto it is Cable. A kick to goal each in this quarter as Cable hooks down towards the Echo player is 16. I'll go through those individual stats in just a moment. There's the siren to start the final quarter. Perth kicking to the left of screen in this turn. The breeze has really died away. It would have been favouring the end of which Subiaco are kicking as Jackson wins the ball down to Cable. Cable hurriedly to half forward. Burgess to Cable. Oh, this could be an early goal. He's usually a good kick on the run. Cable for 45 metres in the space of 20 seconds. Great start to the final quarter. Wayne Blackwell wouldn't have had time to resume his seat. He will need to see a replay of that. 
Cable's got two. And Perth now have their 15th goal. Yes, and he was the player that got he was the player that got the ball out of the mission uh, middle in the first place and then ran on to take the hand pass from Burgess. And as Wally called, Shane Cable on the run is a terrific kick for goal. Balanced himself beautifully, the start that Wayne Blackwell really wanted. Just got his kick in and fortuitously lands with Thompson. Handball out wide to Evans. Evans upfield, the dangerous cable underneath it again in front of Mackenzie. And Perth have started exactly the way that Wayne Blackwell would have wanted them to in this last term. Subiaco need the next goal to stay in touch. There's 16 points in arrears at the moment. Been a terrific game. Cable, kick to the top of the square. Shear is in the pack. So was Paulson. At the back, it's Miller. He can't control it. Burgess hand pass straight to Hampson. He goes across the full back line dangerously. And the Cable has taken the mark. Plays on quickly. Gets around McKenzie. Bounce to steady from 45 metres. Into the square. Hawking's there. Big leap there from uh, Jay Burton. Hampson runs into Cable.